My name is Ron Tarosi, I'm the CEO of uh, 5W Public Relations. First, I want to thank you all for coming. Um, 5W is aggressive, fast growing, plus or minus 100 person PR firm. We're involved in a lot of different things. In your PR firm, come talk to me. Mm -hmm. More important thing today is um, our esteemed guest today is Moshe Gaon, who is the chairman of Gaon Holdings. Um, he's here to discuss a number of different things retail, venture capital, finance, the Israeli economy, and frankly, most importantly, is to look at opportunities of some of you here. Um, so, Moshe today runs the Gaon Fund. He can obviously tell you a lot more about it than I can. Um, he'll speak for a little while, take questions, and take your cards. There's a few colleagues here. So if you're not able to meet him during the event, Shai here as well is with him. Um, so no further ado, Moshe, thank you very much for joining us. Actually, I'm very surprised with the amount of people. I thought we were giving away something for free. And now you aren't? <laughs> we're not giving lunch free here. And hopefully some of you will work with Ron in the future. Actually, it's funny because I met Ron about, I don't know, five months ago. We were sitting in a restaurant and somebody said to me, hey, here's Ron. And we clicked and uh, we became good friends. And I'm very happy to be around. Thanks for arranging this. Thank you. And uh, we actually uh, came here three guys. There is Shai Preminger, who's the CEO of Holding, of Gone Holdings, and Ilan Milo, who was the CEO of our uh, VC fund for uh, Agro Aqua, which is the, the water business we have. And if anybody wants and interested later, we can have uh, discussions on that. What I'm going to do is I'm basically going to give probably like a 15, 20 quick presentation about the Israeli uh, market and about uh, Gone Holdings. And I'll be happy for anyone who wants to, to talk to me uh, later. I'm gonna be on through Sunday, so if anybody wants to sit with me here or get together later, just leave me a number or talk to me and we'll try to arrange it, okay? I'm not sure I can do all of you, but <laughs> some of you I can do. Um, but then again, Shai and Ilil are here for the other businesses as well, so as I go through them, so if you see there's something that interests you, that you can talk to Shai about or to Ilil about, feel free to do it, that's what we're here for. And uh, another last thing to say is that we'll be back here probably in December. So if we are unable to do it now, we'll probably do it again in December. Okay. Uh, so I put this presentation really for just to get the discussion rolling. I'm not sure I have all the answers, and I'm probably not going to be able to tell you more about this crisis than most of the people that you talk to. Uh, but as I see it, there's a, a lot of opportunity in this uh, situation, and I've always been an optimist. I've worked with politicians many years of my life, so. When I saw what happens in politics and in Israel, you know, actually that's a funny story. I, James Carville is a friend of mine who used to work in campaigns together. And uh, one of the things when I met him in uh, Washington, we sat down uh, a while ago after uh, uh, Barack came back. And uh, one of the things he said to me is, you know, you know what's amazing in your country? Everybody comes back. They never go away. They always come back. So the way I look at this recession is that there is a situation here. There's a problem here, but it's going to come back. We don't know how long. No, we don't know when, but we have to think of it that way because that's the only way you can work in business. If you're a person who thinks optimist, then this is an opportunity and there is a time for us to invest, there is a time for us to go into the country, to go into Israel, to possibly look at opportunities in the United States, and that's why we're here. So one thing to remember is that, that you need to show the money. And one of the favorite films I have uh, is, uh, uh, you probably know this, Jerry Maguire. You know this yeah. movie? And one of the best parts of this film is this part here tells me everything about the situation. Jerry! Yeah, well, what, what can I do for you, Ron? You just tell me what can I do for you. It's a very personal, very important thing. Hell, it's a family mind. Are you ready, Jerry? I'm ready. Want well, to make sure you're ready, brother. Here it is. Show me the money. Jerry, you better yell! Show me the money! 
Basically, they don't care about anything, just show me the money. If you have the money, you're in the play, and you have a lot of opportunities. So what I'm going to try and talk to you about is a little about the Israeli economy, <coughs> talk to you about the uh, Gaon Holdings of Oakview, and basically tell all of you why Gaon, in my opinion, is a great place to be if you want to come uh, to Israel. So Israel is really a remarkable success story. If you look at uh, the economy, it's one of the fastest growing economies in the Western world. It grows. And it's probably estimated uh, in 2008 to finish with 4.5 million. Uh, uh, the update for 2009 is a little smaller, but we still are growing 2.7 in the first half. And despite the harsh conditions, the wars, the situation we've gone through, the changes of government, this is probably one of the best growing markets you will ever find in the world.